those tuning in, welcome to yet another episode of Rex and Dimps. Yeah, yeah, that's what's up. Guys, have you noticed how time is flying though? Like, it's Monday and then it's Friday and it's September and then we're headed towards the end of September and then October, November, December 2020. Chai, 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 time is running out. Guys, this year flew. I hope everybody's still working on their 2021 resolutions. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's not too late. Three more months to go. Not too late. Not too late. Those body goals. Those <laughs> whatever. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> yeah, anyway. So today we're having a little bit of fun. Yeah. Uh, we're going to be playing a game. It's quite a common game, but we've been looking to doing it for so long. Um, and it's how well do you know your partner? How well do you know your wife or your husband? And how it's gonna work pretty standard is, for example, I'm going to ask Rex a question, and while he thinks about the answer to that question, I'm going to write the answer on this piece of paper over here, and then he'll answer it, and then I will reveal whether he got it right or wrong, and then he'll do the same. Then we'll collect the points. Whoever wins gets a reward. What's the reward? So the reward is the winner gets to tell the loser to do anything that the winner wants and the loser must do it yeah okay so what we're gonna do is we're going to name our requests up front so mm -hmm. that each one of us know what we're working towards and when you see yourself losing you must know there's <laughs> a reward to give you know yeah yeah so what's your reward that you would like if you win if i win i would like for you to give me your chocolate. Which one? The one that you got. For my birthday? Yes. <laughs> this guy's crazy. What is it again? What is it again? Lint. Yeah, the lint. That's what I want. <laughs> That's what I want if I win. Okay, pick another one. I'm not giving away my birthday chocolate. Um we have a last slice of cake left in the fridge. <laughs> That you say is yours. Wow, wow, wow. So I, I have a piece of cake that I've frozen for myself because I want to, you know, have it another time. It's from my child's birthday cake. So you want that? Oh, wow. It's winter, so, you know. It's not winter. Oh, sorry. Uh, I want it anyway. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if, if you... <laughs> By a miracle win, <laughs> what would you want? So if I win, I would like you to take me out next week, any day of the week, to a restaurant of my choice. Okay, okay, that's fine. Yeah, Thank you. That. Thank you very much. So, we have witnesses and I am going to give proof whether you did it or not on okay. my Insta, on my Instagram, okay? Nice. So... Let's do this. Let's do this. So, are you ready? Yep. I'm going to ask first. What is my least favorite body part? Okay, got it. What is it? Her least favorite body part is her toes. <laughs> Nails. Legs. My least favorite body part <laughs> are my legs. Those <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, Dimps, name a country that I would like to visit that I haven't visited before. Happy <laughs> leg. You're setting me up for failure though. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. What is it? Israel. Ghana. <laughs> um, so, so far it's zero, zero, and we are moving on to question number two. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Okay. Between my mother and my father, who do I consider myself? to be most like so who did i take after the most and name one or two characteristics to substantiate your point okay 
Are you are you ready? Mm-hmm. Okay. So, what is your answer? Your daddy. My daddy. Why? You 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 impulsive like him as you <laughs> explained, <laughs> and you spend too much. Yeah. <laughs> As you've described him to me. Okay. Yeah. And so yeah, that's and two. Yeah. Also no, impulsive yeah, and spender. Yeah. Okay, so maybe I'll give you half a point. Half a point. Okay. Okay. Because I said both. Okay. My mom and dad. And from my dad I said impulsive spender. Ah uh, no, that's a full point. No. And then from my mom, organized. No, but until you both as funny. No! It's a point that. But point. you no no no, but you can't make me choose either or. I have I take after both of them. I, I think it's them. unfair to, to to ask a question and have two answers. No, it is what it is, so let's move. I'm gonna do it as well. No, you no, but it's the truth. It's the truth. Oh. <laughs> Alright, cool, moving on to the next one. Um when I was a child, what did I wanna be when I Don't listen to me. <laughs> <laughs> Don't listen to what you're writing. Yes. <laughs> she's, thing. she's smart this one. She will be able to Don't listen to what to you're hear writing. The pat- you can hear the pattern. This is a <laughs> This is an M. Uh, 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 <laughs> an astronaut. No. A soccer player or a professor? I was gonna give you one point if you got each one of them. There's a play of mine that, that, that is about a child wanting to be an astronaut. So she thought it was biographical. <laughs> no, I know it's not biographical. <laughs> okay, are you ready for the next question? Yep. Okay, so what musical genre or like what type of music do I secretly like? That people don't know I may like. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. Uh, I would say I'm a piano. <laughs> Put it up so that we see. Asian. Asian. House or lounge music. No, but that's that's the attached. I'm a piano and house. No, houses. we don't say attached. Everything is attached to everything. It's a branch. Quieto is attached to hip hop. I'm a piano is a branch of house. No, you must name the exact thing. You got it wrong. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So so are you ready? Mm-hmm. Uh, so this is so we've been quite difficult with each other. I'll give you a, a sort of an easier one. I'll be disappointed mm-hmm. uh, if you don't know it. Mm-hmm. What is my favorite flavor of ice cream? Your favorite flavor of ice cream is anything with chocolate and caramel. No, but... Tin roof. But, so I got it right. What, what, what are the flavors of tin roof? It has chocolate. Okay, I'll give it to you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's what's up, I got a wine. So, outside of my career, right? What is something that I consider myself naturally talented at? Okay. You got it? Name two. Okay. No, but you need to Okay, if, fine. If, if you're saying fine. two, each one of the two I must I must you must Fine. No, one. one. One is fine. Mm-hmm. So you are like I don't know, like you put things together like an organizer, planner. What did you write? You got it right. Administration. Oh, yes. Similar. Yeah. Oh, nice. Cool. 1.5 to 1. What is my least favorite housework chore? So, ask the question again. Of all the housework chores, which one is my least favorite? Simple. Everything. (laughs) No, you have to be specific. No. (laughs) That's not funny. You have to be specific. <laughs> you, you, are you trying to say I'm not into uh, house chores? Is it a lie? Okay. If I must choose one out of everything he doesn't like, it's like literally I, I, I just need to do this and come out with anyone and he doesn't like it. Anyway, sweeping and mopping. <laughs> Dishes! <laughs> uh, I'm still winning. One last question. Of all the achievements 
I have managed to collect so far. Which one am I most proud of? Okay, okay so let's say, let's say career. Career. Because yeah. I know you were gonna say being a mom. Mm -hmm. That's a given. <laughs> That's a given. Okay. Um, are you thinking of it? Mm -hmm. Okay. I would say. Um, Passing your masters with distinction. Nope. I I must say, you know what? I'll give you a half a point because I had to really think about it, right? Obviously, passing masters with distinction was a great achievement. Um, but upon really thinking about it, passing my undergrad, my Bachelor of Arts, my honors degree, is my most Why? proud because my undergrad while i was still the the years between passing matric and getting my first degree have been the most challenging years of my entire life and it took me so long to finish my degree and i failed and i transferred universities and i was having such a difficult time that i really didn't think i would pass I didn't think I would get through at all and I did so that was literally the most yo it was the most proud moment when I got onto that stage and I and I and I collected that certificate because of everything I had been through to get there now last question um, this is the determining question what does your partner mostly look forward to on the weekend mm -hmm. rest the UFC <laughs> <laughs> I watch this every I Saturday night it's not true though but I watch UFC every Saturday night but you watch it every weeknight as well I mean, but that's what I look forward to mostly. But you watch it also during the week. It's an unfair answer. Ask something else. Uh, I win! This was not a fair game. Can I have my slice of cake, please? Now. Yeah, you fetch it for yourself. Uh, 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 go fetch cake for me. Da, 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 da. Uh, the slice of cake that she had left for herself, but that is now mine. Um, these, uh, ladies and gentlemen, are the fruits of knowing your partner better. Thank you for not knowing me as much as I do you. <laughs> so thank you for joining us today please remember to subscribe to the channel please remember to like the video please remember to drop a comment we love you guys so much like we really do we really appreciate all of you like so much love have a great weekend guys goodbye okay now give me back my cake uh -uh. <laughs> <laughs>